Hey everybody, Chris here, you join Off Road in North Carolina. Wrapping up a pretty cool and very unique van. It's a 2002 E350 V10 Chateau. Rare color too, it's this green color. I've only seen it a few times, I don't even know the name of it. Um, but yeah, this, this customer definitely found a gem and I hope he plans to keep it for a long time. Low mileage, I think it's under 60,000 miles. This is definitely an extremely unique van. So, now to the, to the nitty gritty. Six inch kit, normally I would say on 35s, but this is a 285-75-17 the customer wanted. Uh, it's a Falcon Wild Peak AT on some Mayhem wheels. Turned out pretty cool. Uh, so, six inch on whatever those are, 33s I guess. Got a stage two front axle. 456 gears, Detroit True Track. All the normal stuff. So this is stage two, so it has unit bearings on it. Doesn't have a hub conversion or the upgraded brakes. Single Fox 2.0. All the usual goodies. Uh, front bumper did not want to come off. It's very common on the E-Series where the plastic, the, the, the uh, bumper bolts are captured in a plastic housing and they like to strip out and break. So we usually have to cut them off. Normally we have enough scrap bumpers the spare bumpers where we can repair that and put it back on, uh, but we do not right now. And I couldn't find the pieces I needed in time. Talked to the customer and he said he plans on upgrading the bumper at some point soon anyway. So we just bolted up the front frame support <clears throat> and he can add his bumper of choice in the future. I did say it's V10, so it's a 4R100 transmission. That came out, got a full rebuild with four wheel drive conversion, all the upgraded stuff that we do on all of our transmission jobs with a full two year nationwide warranty. Behind that is an NV271 T case, manual shift. Also with the nationwide warranty for two years. And that's about all we did with this guy. Regeared the rear end, soft the brakes, got that all up to date and looking pretty and new. Changed to 456s of course. Stock semi float Dana 60. All set up. 1350 CV drive shafts front and rear. And this thing's ready to go. So we've been putting test miles on it. It got its final transmission check yesterday from our builder. We do that on everything we build the transmission for, too. We build it, I mean, we take it out here. He bench builds it. We put it back in. We get um, filled up to temperature, check the fluid, and then it goes out to him. He does a thorough check. He scans it, drives it, makes sure everything is perfect before it leaves his place. So that's it for this one. Thanks for watching as always. If you don't follow us on Instagram and Facebook, please do. And hope you have a great day.